Welcome back to SA Live. Well, it's a family-owned business making natural products that care for you and your home. Oh, and it's already starting to fizz. <laughs> <laughs> we've been, Coming we've been up, dying to do the, the little watch us get bomb bombed. <laughs> <laughs> Amy Beerstead, owner of, of From Scratch Farm, is here to teach us a couple of things. Good afternoon. And you said this is just, I mean, not only your, your business, but your passion, yes, right? Yes. How is it a passion? For the last six years, um, somebody, something prompted me to really look at ingredients which I really hadn't paid attention to before. Not just ingredients in bath and body products, but also in our food. And it's amazing what they're putting in our processed foods, what we're putting on our skin, in our hair. I needed to change that. Do better for our health and for our skin. Okay. All right. And we're going to be making a couple of those products today. What are we starting with? I'm starting you with our bath salts. Okay. All right. So I have measured out the two cups Epsom salt. Epsom salts first. Dump and this that is in. just regular old Epsom salt yes. you get at the, the grocery store. Mm -hmm. Good for what ails you, right? Okay. Yes. And then a half cup of the sea salt. And this is uh, the pink? Pink Himalayan sea salt, yes. What's different about that than rock salt that you sprinkle on your driveway? Not I mean, it's like that, but why is this so good? I Better quality. That. This has health benefits. Oh, really? Um, and then you're going to add two tablespoons of dry botanicals. And, and what, are, what do I choose from here? This is rose petals, mm -hmm. lavender, chamomile, and marigold. And right. you can pick any two tablespoons. What are you going to go with? Lavender. I'm going to guess rose. And rose, rose petals. Yeah. Yes. Gosh, I know you so well. Just, just like back in college. <laughs> and then we drop in essential oils. I brought along lemon and lavender. Choose what oh, you do, want. Uh, I'm going to do the lavender. I'm going to go all lavender here. And I went ahead and took the dropper off, so you'll want to use the okay. measuring spoon. And mix that up, and that's good to go. So the, Epsom, the bath salts are going to make a very salty, clear bath that's great for aches, pains, detoxifying, really great for your systems. Oh, so this, that's like the relaxation. Yes. This is when mom says, leave me alone. Don't, don't talk to me. Don't come near me for a half an hour. I'm going to soak in the tub. This is what's in the tub, right? <laughs> but then I also brought all the ingredients that we use mm -hmm. to make our tub teas. Okay. I start with two cups of the sea salt. So that's okay. the bulk the same? of this recipe. Okay. Yes. Same sea salt. And then a whole cup of baking soda. And this, these are the, uh, kind of like that milk bath, right? Yes. A little bit, okay, because where it kind of seeps in there with you with? Because of the half cup of the powdered goat's milk. Goat's milk. Goat's milk? Yes. Wow, really? And then I add an eighth cup of every single one of these. So that would be. That, okay, so this is the cup. marigold. So this ends up being beautiful. And this makes a milky bath. That is, yeah. instead of detoxifying, your for you. mm -hmm. there we go, thank you. This is going to be better for your skin, moisturization, for eczema, psoriasis, dry skin. It is luxurious. And it would be beautiful if you want to pour it in the tub like this, but when I sell it in the store... Do you, do you put the uh, oil in there too? Yes. Okay. Yes, same amount as the bath Here's salt. Here's this little thingy. Okay. There you go. And now, like I said, this is gorgeous, but to sell it in our store, I drop it into tea bags. I seal these up, and you drop the whole tea bag into your bath. It steeps. Mm -hmm. The milk runs out into the bath water. It's beautiful, and it smells delicious. Oh, wow. And, the, yeah, this, I mean, the, the one that I put together with the, the lavender and the rose petals here, just, it does. You could just whiff this all day long and get <laughs> relaxed from it. So. Oh, my gosh, I love and it. And what and other kind of uh, little products besides the bath bombs do you have up there? I create everything that I could that I could easily change the chemicals in our home. So I started off with what you're touching right now is what I started my business with. It's our all-purpose salve. It is made with just beeswax, olive oil, coconut oil, and essential oils that have healing and antibacterial properties. Good for diaper rash. So we have been putting it on diaper rash, cuts, rashes, sunburn, eczema, psoriasis, Trying to think of the other uses. <laughs> and that, that right there helped get you in Best of the City, right? By San yes. Antonio Magazine. Congratulations. San Antonio Magazine awarded that Editor's Choice this oh, past fantastic. spring. Okay. All right. Amy, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. All right. For more information, of course, on From Scratch Kitchen, just head to our website and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab.